this is Kevin. And Andrew. Thanks for tuning in to Hi-Fi. This week we'll be discussing uh, music, anime, in- current interests, and games. Um, start off, Andrew. Um, what music have you been listening to so far? I've been listening to a lot of Cherry Cokes, dude. Like, Cherry Coke? Yeah. yeah. I mean, after that, after um, the, that time you showed me, I was like, wow, Japanese Irish punk. Yeah, I don't really like it because it's like, it's like too many genres put together. Like, I'm I'm thinking like a lot of people just like it just for the novelty, you know? Like, yeah, they're like finding a Japanese Irish punk yeah, band like, like <laughs> they're gonna love it. Yeah, I, I like it because of the novelty. Yeah, well, I'm, but like, their their music's not that bad. They, like I can tell that, but I just don't see myself. I don't see myself uh, liking them. Yeah, you they're. Know? Not, I, I showed a couple of my friends. Not a lot of them actually like it. Like, yeah, I'm not into this Irish stuff. Well, they like the other people that like um, American bands over Japanese bands. I, I guess, yeah. Biased motherfucker. <laughs> you can say that. Oh yeah, biased motherfuckers. The internet. The internet. You can't censor me. Fuck you, R I A A or F C C. Fuck the system. I've been listening like I've actually just been listening to a lot of albums like um, whatever I can get like Bump of Chicken Asian Kung Fu Generation uh, Polizix a lot of Polizix and uh, the Bionic Commando Rearm soundtrack that's really good yeah that was it's pretty cool in my car yeah like Subwoofer right yeah um Kim Stock just bump it I wish mine has a like my mom's. Which has a. I, th- I think your your mom's car should have a subwoofer. I'll I'll see. Yeah. Um. Is there anything that you listen to like um? It was like you regret listening to it back in the day. Regret listening to. Yeah, because I know I have some. <sighs> who's that guy? That who's that guy? That, Cisco. Cisco. Yes. Uh, like fucking, you, like uh, you actually listen to Cisco. Yeah, I actually listen to Cisco. Like, oh, he's cool. Thong song. Like, that's like the only song I've heard. Him that's the only song I've heard from him. But I regret listening to that. The thong song. It's horrible. I, I like. If you go back and listen to it, wow. That was the nineties, man. The nineties were the nineties. They were awesome. cool, but like it spawned a lot of bad stuff too. Cisco. Like, whatever happened to the Backstreet Boys? I, re- I regret actually getting into NSYNC and Backstreet Boys. Really? Like, I actually did. I, I, was, I like, was an NSYNC fanboy, too. Like, why would I do that? Like, you, I you guess I like their songs, but... It's, it's kind of hard to, like, not get into them when everybody else in America yeah, loves like, them. Yeah, like, you get sucked in. It's fucking pop. Well, I know better now. Yeah, but Britney Spears is the shit. I don't care what Britney anybody Spears? says. I heard someone say like Britney Spears like it's not she's not as good as she was back then. Like she doesn't sing, like actually sing anymore. It's just like the her music is still catchy. It's just she doesn't sing as well as she did back then. Yeah, she's not really doing her thing yet. Maybe later. Yeah, maybe. Maybe she's like waiting for some big opportunity. Keith Ledger, you know. Yeah. Speaking of Heath, he w- I, he won a um, Golden Globe, I think, or Emmy or some shit. Well, did he pick it up himself? <laughs> That's a bad joke. Like I know, because I remember this one. I remember someone saying like, Heath Ledger, <laughs> like he's not really dead. They're gonna make Dark Knight too. With Joker and be like, everybody's gonna be like, oh, it's gonna be bad. There's a Joker, and then but Heath Ledger's gonna be in it, and he's gonna be like, ah, I fooled you. That's gonna be the best movie ever. Somebody said that. <laughs> it was a funny. It was a funny idea. Oh. Like that'd be cool, man. That'd be so awesome. <laughs> um. Yeah. Dead time. <laughs> yeah. Um, what else? Do you have anything in the on. Oh yeah. We oh, recently get into Pompadour pants yes, now. Yes. I. I'm getting, I'm getting really into the pompadour movement. If there isn't one, there is one now. 
Well, like Kishidan, I mean, they're, and those uh, those bikers that have pompadours, man. The Bosozoku, they're wow, you know. Yeah. That uh, I've been uh, doing a lot of research on the pompadour. Where do you research a pompadour? Like Wikipedia? And Google. Google. And Google's my friend. Is there like some sites that teach you how to make one? Yeah, there 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 are a few, but they're they don't teach you how to make the outrageous pompadour they all they, they oh. teach you how to make like the elvis or james dean pomp oh like the not over the top one not the one that flies five feet over your head yeah like those are the ones gravity defying pompadours like like that the japanese really got it down yeah like like they're the last people they're the last kind of people i would i would think of uh, getting a pompadour down yeah i don't i mean i was i i, I was looking it up and i saw harajuku elvises i was like what's this I watched the video and it's these like f- 50, 60 year old Japanese men dressed up as greasers dancing in Yoyogi Park on Sundays. That must be some wild time. It, like, it's, it's pretty outrageous. Like all every Sunday, like I want to know if they like have that pompadour every day. Yeah, that's what and I want to know too. And and do they work with a pompadour? That. I need to find that out because if they do work with a pompadour, I will work with a pompadour as well. Like whoever hires you with a pompadour, that's the best manager ever. I know, a pomp. You can't beat that with a baseball bat. <laughs> yeah, Kishidan's really good. Yeah. Yeah, I re- the the one song um, Zoku. Yeah. That video. Baseball. Was, holy shit. <laughs> that's that's, that's like, extreme. People die, die in that bad. baseball. <laughs> Extreme pompadour baseball, and uh, like all all their music videos, you you notice that are they're like really, they're really uh, they're, they're over the top. Yeah, they're um, they're crazy. Like um, wedding march. Oh yeah, with with the dad and he farts. <laughs> I think that was a fart. It was a fart. <laughs> he starts crying like a little baby. That was. And when, when I saw that, I, was, I, I couldn't stop laughing. Like, wow, can it get any more embarrassing? Yeah. Dance. Yeah. <laughs> Japanese people love their, uh, pada their pada, dude. coordinated dances, man. Yeah, they're... I think it has to do with more of their, like, culture. Yeah, yeah. But, um, all right, moving on. 